All right, what have we here? Maiden model, JR Signature. Smells good. Oh, that's interesting back and sides. Good people, what's up? It's Pete Thorne. Welcome to my studio. Hey, I am here in cahoots, in collaboration, in conjunction with Guitar World Magazine for another review of another fine guitar-related product. In this case, it is a guitar. It's this one right here. You heard it on all the guitar parts on the track at the beginning of the video. Coming to you all the way from Australia, it's a Maiton Guitars JR or Joe Robinson signature model. Now, Maiton Guitars started in 1940 or so, the early 1940s anyway, in Australia by a fellow named Bill May. He's a jazz musician from Melbourne. Did I say that right? Australians? I hope so. Uh, and uh, he wanted to start a guitar company as kind of an answer to all the great American-made guitars. There was nothing domestically going on really for uh, guitar production in Australia at that time. So he thought, you know, everything's Gibson and Martin and all these brands from the U.S. I'm going to start my own company. So he did. And the company's still family-owned to this day. Now, Joe Robinson, who this guitar is named after, great guitar player from Australia, and he's been playing these guitars, he's mating guitars for about 15 years now, and finally he's got his own signature model. Kind of reminds me of my trajectory with Sir, although I wasn't 14 when I started playing Sirs. But nonetheless, you know, great family-owned company, and one day you end up with your own signature model. It's a really cool thing, something to be proud of. So, Joe, good on you. Now, he's a terrific guitar player. I put the link to his YouTube channel in the video description below, so you can click there and check it out. Lots of great lessons there lots of great insight and just some really great music so be sure and check out Joe if you haven't seen his channel yet he's got five solo albums to his name he's done a ton of touring he also plays clinics and workshops all over the world he's just a cool guitar player to check out for sure and he's designed a really nice guitar so let's get on to that so double a grade uh, spruce Sitka spruce top and the back and sides are I'm gonna have to look this up what are the sides and back Tasmanian myrtle. I thought for a minute that the wood might be like roasted maple or something just from the look of it. It's got a little bit of flame to it, uh, but anyway, it's Tasmanian myrtle. It's got a mahogany neck and the fingerboard and bridge are made of rosewood. The outer binding here actually is rock maple. I should say the frets are really beautiful, like really nicely polished and just kind of like look impeccable and feel great as well under the fingers. Guitar comes with strap buttons already installed. That's pretty nice. I always feel weird when I get an acoustic and it doesn't have the button here especially installed and you gotta screw into the guitar into the neck heel. And I don't know, I just feel like I wish they'd done that. So it's nice that they did do that in this case. Now the guitar has a really, really cool pickup and preamp system in it, so more on that now. So the JR Signature model has a really cool sounding pickup slash microphone system built in. So what I'm gonna do for this part of the video is just record the guitar on my Slate uh, microphone here, and then at the same time, I'm also gonna record the sound coming out of the guitar. We can compare the two. So it's called the AP5 Pro, the pickup system. You can see it here. It's just exceedingly simple. You've got a bass control, you've got a treble control, you've got a volume control, and then you've got a parametric mid control right here so that you can switch up the frequency as well as boost or cut 
the mid-range. And then you've got two volume controls here. One is for the under saddle pickup system, and then the other one controls a microphone that you can actually see inside the sound hole of the guitar. In practice, I'm finding that this is some of the most natural acoustic sounds I've heard coming out of a, a plugged-in acoustic in a long time. So on the song at the beginning of the video, the main guitar part, the one that um, starts the song and finishes the song, that's a blend of the internal uh, pickup as well as the internal microphone. I simply just compressed it a little bit in my DAW and that was it, add a little bit of reverb and that's the sound that you hear. So the guitar records really well with the built-in system and I could see it working really good live as well. Now you'll have to be careful with the microphone level when you play live because I'm sure, especially if you've got a monitor on stage, there's a potential for feedback there. But let's start off with just, let's say, well, let's start off with the microphone. I'll turn uh, the internal pickup all the way down and we'll just listen to the way that the microphone sounds. Okay, let's just check out only the pickup now. So I'll bring up the volume for the pickup about halfway. And now let's blend them both together at about halfway. So about, about equal blends of pickup and microphone. So pretty cool natural sound. There's not a ton of bass coming out of that mic and I'm sure that's um, probably uh, on purpose because you know if you have too much low end you're gonna get um, crazy feedback coming out of a guitar with a microphone. Let's just try playing with my fingers for a second here. Now, all in all, the guitar seems super solid, really well built. I'm quite impressed with it. Um, it's easy to play, it sounds great. The pickup system is exceptional, I think. Thanks for watching my video on the Joe Robinson Signature Model from Mayton Guitars, terrific guitars coming to you from Australia. It's a great sounding guitar, great playing guitar. You can check it out further at the link down there in the video description below. Click there, it'll take you to all the info about this guitar as well as all the other nice models from the folks at Mayton Guitars in Australia. Be sure and check out my friends at Guitar World. I put the link to uh, their channel down in the video description below. And hey, if you wouldn't mind, if you haven't done it already, please hit subscribe. Hit the little bell beside the subscribe. You'll get an alert every time I put out a new video. Thanks for watching my channel. I really appreciate you being here. You guys take care. I'll see you soon. Over and out.